For about two weeks now, the researchers at Exploit Prevention Labs have been watching an interesting puzzle. Our community intelligence network has been seeing search engine references to an exploit site in Russia called smarttrack.org. Now, one of the most interesting searches that led there was Better Business Bureau, all as one word. We could never figure out how they were doing it, but eventually our researchers discovered that about one in every three times that that search was sent into Google, Link Scanner would detect that the number one sponsored link was actually linking firstly to smarttrack.org, which then redirected immediately to the real bbb.org. And while the redirection was happening, however, it was silently installing a post logger on your system. It happened so quickly that an ordinary user just wouldn't even see it. And as you can see by looking at the Google results page, the top sponsored link and the top non-sponsored or organic link both look very similar. Well, they would if it wasn't for Link Scanner's red X verdict beside one of them. But if you weren't running something like Link Scanner, how would a user know which was the correct link to click? And the answer is that the user cannot tell. Look at this screen. If you position the cursor over the top of any organic link, Google shows you what URL you'll be heading for if you click it. It shows that down in the browser status bar there in the bottom left hand corner of the screen. But look at this screen. Now if you position the mouse over the sponsored link, the status bar remains blank. There's no way to know where you're heading. The only way to know what's on the other side of that link is to click it. Fortunately, Link Scanner pre-scans Google results and Yahoo results and MSN results uh, looking for bad things. And this is the reason for the red X. And if you position the mouse over the red X, it shows you why it thinks the site is bad. In this case, it shows that the link is actually to a place called smarttrack.org and that there's what's called an MDAC or an MS06014 exploit being thrown by that site. If your system is not patched, that exploit installs a backdoor and a post logger, which is like a key logger, but much more powerful. It captures the whole screen and makes it easy for the bad guys to tell what keystrokes belong to the password and what belongs to the username and what the secret question is and what the secret answer is. And it's its job to answer to its job is to capture all those user IDs and passwords that you enter on the web. Here now is a real time video of a machine being nailed just so that you can see how quick it is and how hard it is to tell. Here we are at a at a normal Google search page. The user types in his search, Better Business Bureau, and the results come back. There's a results page. The user clicks on the tainted sponsored link and is sent seemingly immediately to the real BBB page. But in the background, unwanted programs are being installed. And there you are. That's what came in while we were trying to read the Better Business Bureau page. Voila, nailed in 30 seconds.